Please use this app responsibly, watch first and practice later. The beauty of designing a skating program is that we get the choice of how to prepare you for each and every move. And every part of your backwards crossovers that you're about to learn, you have encountered in your earlier stages of learning here on this course. So now let's stitch everything together so you can easily learn your backwards crossovers. I've set myself up on my giant hockey circle, remembering feet following the circle, upper body turn to face into the circle and of course as I'm skating around I'm going to want to look where I'm going. At the moment I'm looking at you guys because the camera's over there but I should be looking where I'm skating. So now I'm going to bend my knees and start with a half lemon. Pressing out and around and now I'm going to be drawing that foot to cross paths with the other one. This little skill you've already learnt when you were skating forwards lemons and crossing the pathway of your feet. Now when we're doing this backwards, we're going to cause the turn of the feet to happen by gently tweaking the heels slightly towards each other. A little bit of turn out of the toes with the heels coming towards each other. But remember, so that your feet don't clash into each other, you're going to need to have a slight win and lose scenario going on. So the pushing foot, the half lemon foot, ends up slightly left behind, left ahead here. And then we're going to gently let those feet pass by each other until we finish with the feet crossed. Now the foot that just crossed in front, that's now carrying my body weight. So if I want to release that back foot, it should be pretty easy to do so. And when I do, I'm just gonna pick that foot up and bring it right next to the opposite foot, ready to start all over again. Now, when we're doing this action, it's very common to have our upper body want to twist and turn back in two. And I'm going to really encourage you to try and maintain a good still and locked position facing into your circle. As with most things, there are stages of learning. So whilst we're doing our first learning of the shapes that make our backwards crossover sew together, we're going to be focusing on our main push as the half lemon. But one day, when we cross our feet, you'll get a second push. Not today, but it will happen in the future. So let's focus one more time. We start with our bend, press away the half lemon, sliding that left foot from the half lemon, sliding that foot over as the opposite one slides underneath. We're gonna make sure now that that foot has slid underneath, we're releasing the weight. You notice how this foot is now at a slight angle because I've released the weight from that foot. I'm carrying myself on that crossed inner foot and the crossed outer foot now has less weight so that I can bring it back next to the other one and go again. Stroking, sliding and crossing back together. Stroking, sliding and then drawing those feet back together. Let's see those backwards crossovers connected and with flow. As you become more proficient and start to build speed, keeping our observation, looking where we're skating is going to become super important. Also notice that we're emphasizing here the together moment after each backwards crossover. So we're going stroke, cross, back together. This is to help emphasize the fact that we need a good strong half lemon push and a good balance point in between each crossover. Our hockey demonstrator Vitale is demonstrating the next level of confidence here we're taking much more flow through the crossing action and starting to blend the stroke with the next step to start the push. So you'll notice he strokes, he crosses, and he starts to reach and stroke simultaneously for the next crossover. That's our target eventually. And finally, we're going to take a nice, strong close-up view of the feet during the crossover action so we can see the stroke, the half lemon, the slide across, and that both feet are responsible for crossing paths. A 
purpose. Me. Okay. We still going? Okay, go. Okay, that'll do. That'll do.